the outside, I look pretty healthy. But there's too many days like this. Thankfully, the dogs are well behaved and quiet. I'd rather be sick here in Scorched Freedom enjoying the nice weather, I guess, than freezing my butt off up north. Bubba Box Truck Corey! Guys, all the days in the desert aren't good ones. When you're sick, man, life sucks. I got the fan going to keep the weather decent and the temperature decent in here. And I feel miserable. I'm sweating. I'm nauseous. I'm puking. It's uh, no fun at all. Having all kinds of GI problems, acid reflux, nausea, vomiting. It's not a fun day at all, guys. Can we see the thermometer? It says 91. It's not crazy uncomfortable in here. I'm just having a nap with the dogs. I got my puke bucket right here. That's this morning's oatmeal, along with some drinks and water and Coke and some medication. What do you do? I don't know, but the smell of this pile of puke is starting to get to me, so I'm going to take it over to the compost hole. I keep these little buckets around. It's a multi-purpose kind of deal, because when you're sick, you just don't have much warning. It's a beautiful day here in Saab City too. I just don't feel like enjoying it. One thing that's true though, is when you have a camp set up, it makes it a whole lot easier to be sick. It's uh, never fun. Got another teepee set up down there for visitors. It's good having the burn barrel in the camp. Get rid of garbage that'll burn. And over here is the compost pit. It's a uh, good way to get rid of more garbage. Here we go, guys. It's coming out both ends like that. I don't know. Not good, not good at all. See? People with disabilities, people that are sick, it's not always obvious. On the outside, I look pretty healthy, but there's too many days like this. I sure prefer to be sick when I can be parked, just lie down, take it easy. It's, uh, it's a lot tougher if you're driving or on a boat or you need to be functional in some way. It's, uh, it's just part of the, the deal for me, I guess. It is what it is. The, uh, the camp's fairly quiet. Tammy's building her house. I don't know if you can see it down there. We're going to do a tour of that another time. Let's go back in. Rinse out the puke bucket, lie back down. I still got dishes to wash and mess to clean up. Thankfully the dogs are well behaved and quiet. They're always easy to deal with, at least usually. Dopey likes my pillow though. I'm still loving the foot pump. Got to appreciate the conveniences in life, even Even when you're sick. I'd rather be sick here in Scorched Freedom enjoying the nice weather, I guess, than freezing my butt off up north. If you're going to be sick, you might as well be sick where the weather's nice. I got work everywhere. Everywhere I look, I see work I got to do. Some things have gotten done, though. Maybe in this video you'll notice some new things. Fans running. Got it hooked up because it's getting hot around here now. My ugly ass fly strip hanging from it, but you know, it works. Every fly it catches is one I don't have to. Well, time to put on YouTube. 
Netflix. Lie down. One thing's for sure. Won't be much work getting done today. So what is the answer? I had a gastroenterologist I was working with before I headed south, and maybe if I had stayed up north, I'd have these problems sorted out, and I wouldn't be in this mess today, but what are you supposed to do? Get sick and then just hang out at the hospital and doctor's offices forever? I'd rather try and enjoy my time. But I tell you right now, I sure wish that gastroenterologist could figure this out. He's not sure that it's related to the sarcoid. He thinks it's something separate, but I don't know. Everything I get sick with lately is related. I think in the end they'll discover it is, but in the meantime, I'm sick of being sick. From Slab City, I'm Box Truck Corey. Enjoy your time. Live your days. Because you never know when sickness is around the corner.